day and welcome to Farming Live Australia. Today we're going to go and plant cane. Darren, this is a setup for planting the cane. How does it work? Well, we've cut the, cut the stick. Yeah. Now I'll get two girls on the back here eventually. Yep. And they will just feed them in. Feed those go. stalks of cane yep. in, yep. Walks through. And where do they go? They'll go through the machine. They what get... in that hole there? Yep, through okay. there. They get chopped, the drills ploughed out, goes in, chemicals, fertiliser and covered up. So these boxes here, they've got fertiliser, fertilizer they automatically yep. fertilise the cane? Yep, put a set of band each side. Oh, okay. And it's all done. No One more time, done. Darren, they did actually plant it all by hand. Yes, they drill the rows and then go along and cut all the sticks. Men when you say drill it, you mean plough like a... a plough like a, this. Yeah. And then lay the cane in, cut it with a cane knife. Yeah, and right. cover it all up. Take forever, wouldn't it? Well, that's what they did. Yeah, right, eh? We're pretty modernised now. How long, how long ago would they have planted by hand? Oh, many years ago now. Like, have you ever had no, to plant by no, hand? No, not in your lifetime. No, not in my lifetime. And have you been on, have you been working on cane your whole life? Yeah, since we've been at Stone River. Yeah. Since okay. We're kids. All right. On the planter. Yep. On the trailers, cleaning the trash off years ago. When we okay. That's what we had to do. All right, well, in a minute we'll get started and you can show us what you right. do. Well, <laughs> so, your name is? Rhiannon. Rhiannon Harrigan. Yes. And you're going to help Dad plant cane? Oh, yes. Do you like it? Oh, it's not too bad. Not, not too bad? Yep. Does he not feed you if you don't do it? Oh, he can get pretty, pretty toey if we don't do it. That's really? for sure, yeah. Okay. <laughs> and who, who cuts all the cane? The, the tractor cuts it, it's on the, what do you call it dad? The plant cutter. The plant cutter. And they basically, in the drills like them there, and we just run down one drill and um, gets it's cut off at the harvest. base. It's like a mini harvester really, yeah. Yeah. And it loads it for us and we're on Does the back Does it make you itch, itchy or anything, that stuff? Oh yeah, for sure. That's so, for sure. <laughs> yeah. So what do you do if I don't have a bath to get rid of it? You just get used to it, I guess, and you just... Put up with it. Put up with it. You don't really have a choice. Okay. Yep. All right. Let's have a look at one of these other girls. See what they got to say. Taylor. 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 This is Taylor Harrigan. Is it? Yeah. And so you know, I suppose you've been laying around the beach all night, have you? And now you're going to help Dad. Yeah. You have. Yeah. And now you're going to help Dad. Yeah. And do you like plate and coat? I'm doing it for a little while. Yeah, for how long? <laughs> how long, Dad? Oh, well, four or five years now. Yeah, right. On. And do you ever have to get men to do it, like helpers, or do you always do it? No, we no. always do it. <laughs> always do it. <laughs> you always do it. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> uh, and are you going to be a cane farmer when you grow up? Oh. Well, grow up more. I mean, you are pretty grown I don't up. know. <laughs> you don't know? Nah. Don't. So what's your name? Dimity. Dimity. Okay. And you, you, have you been at the beach today too, or have you been at school? School. School. And do you like planting cane? Yeah, it's all right. You like it? Yeah. <laughs> Better than at school. <laughs> Better than at school? Yep. All right. Okay, and what do you do on weekends? Usually come up to the farm. Come up to the farm and yep. help? Yeah, sort of. Yep. Can you drive the tractor? <laughs> no. No. What about the other girls? Can they drive the tractor? Yeah. They can. And how long before you'll learn? I don't know. You don't know. Sure. All right, thanks, Dimity. Thanks. <laughs> oh, I forgot to mention there's one extra fella here that skipped getting on the camera, and that's Jet. He's a ring in. Okay, so the sticks go in the hole. Right.
What are you doing now? Uh, cleaning the trash off so when we go back down the drill it doesn't get caught up as much. Oh, yeah. It's easier to put through the chute. Yep. Yeah. Okay, Rihanna, I notice that you've planted this cane, but where you planted the canes in a ditch, how come when I saw them harvesting the other day, it was up on top of a hill? It wasn't down in a ditch like that. Um, yeah, so over time, so we planted in like this, over time, Dad will get to the ground, so we'll wait a bit now, and um, when the shoots start to come up out of the ground, he'll spray it, get rid of all the grass, um, burn off with a bit of gramoxone and pre-emergent. Um, over time, we'll leave it then a little bit, and then he'll come back through and he'll level it all till the ground's good. Um, then once he levels it... When you say ground, level it, do you mean like, will he use a plough or something and push push the soil yeah, so over the top? Put, yeah, he'll then work this ground, so he'll probably see all the excess dirt along the side of the cane, he'll push it all in and um, pre -em like, yeah, just put it put it back to level so see how, when you see it when it gets cut and everything yeah so he'll do that and then once it's up like that he'll put the fertilizer so how, how high has it got to be before he has to fertilize it oh give or take depends on what kind of year you have it's roughly to say but oh no it'll like be, a meter yeah it'll be a, so far out of the ground it'll have the tops on and everything and how often does he have to um would he have to fertilize it oh depending on what dad really wants to do He's a boss man, so um, oh no, probably go over once with the fertilizer, once or twice. Yeah. Depending on then the weather though, because you're not going to. So have... when the cane gets up tall, like when it's two or three meters high, how do they fertilize it then? Um, so depending on what Dad wants to do, they've got um, he will either get the spray plane in. Oh, they so, use an aeroplane. Yeah, so they can use the aeroplane. They'll bring the choppers, choppers in the fertilizer. Ah. Okay, well that's very interesting. Yeah. Thanks for that. That's alright. <laughs> Time for a scenic flight. We'll have a bit of a look around the area where we are. You know, I've been on a lot of farms in Australia and one thing that always impresses me is how the whole family pitches in together to get things done. I'm sure the kids were really glad when I went away. A couple of them were terrified of that camera. <coughs> like all country kids. They're really not used to being in the spotlight. Well, Darren, thanks a lot for letting us come and see you plant cane with your family. No, not a problem. And uh, have you got a stock whip to keep these girls in order or what? Uh, shotgun. Shotgun. <laughs> shotgun is easier. What, for the girls or the blokes? 
Both. Both. Thanks, girls. Thank yeah. you.